Hey there, guys, gals, fans, and pals. Your buddy John Megacycle here. Oh, another episode of Blaster Master 03. Oh, this is kind of a cheap way to get my energy back up. Or it's a way. Anyway. Okay. SF facilities are guarded by combat drones that attack any intruders. I figured that out so far. It's too dangerous to just charge in. Is there some way to go around? There sure is. Now what? SF Dungeon 1. Okay. Man, this isn't confusing at all. There's dungeons, there's dungeon... SF dungeons. Hey, that worked. Dang it. Oh, well, that worked just as well. I want to go left and up and at least clear out that room. All kinds of oddities. I don't even know how to, like, narrate or explain what's happening. That's kind of the fun of a blind playthrough. Oh, the landmine jerk again! Yeah, I remember you. From the second game. Got everything? Cool. Oh, not cool. Well, let's clear everything. <laughs> if I'm gonna come to an area, I'd like to clear it out as much as I possibly can, as possible as I am able. I know that's gonna be impossible because I'm gonna need certain tools and certain power-ups or whatever, but the more I can cover, the better. No items in this area? Nope, okay, cool. Let's go a less dangerous route. Yeah. Through fract... Uh, super space. Super fractal nonsense over here. Yeah, that was significantly safer. Uh, yeah, no joke, it kind of was. If the item I need is already here, then whatever. Another guard. Kane. Kane Gardner, please come in. It's Jason. Jason Fudruckers. Uh, a place. <laughs> I'm hacking an SF communications facility in the Dome City. I disguised the signal, so we should be safe for now. Oh, man. Shady old terrorist? What? Sorry, I have something I need to ask you about. When I was tracking Eve's signal, I found some of Eve's DNA. I think that's pronounced gynoid. Since you were involved in the development of MAs and support... Drones? Droids? I thought you might know something. But you're a surrogate father and it's not your... Okay, whatever. I see. Eve? Eve would help me? 
Find Eve. Okay. Oh, Jennifer. Her name was with yours when Sophia Zero was sent to Earth. How in the world do you discern someone's origin from DNA? Like, not genetic or- okay, whatever. So we need to get to the satellite Nora. Looks like we'll have to ship out from this planet then. Yeah. I- I could have only guessed. <laughs> okay. Sure. What about me inside of the machine? Won't I go splat? Yeah, that's exactly what I just said. Won't I? Okay. Yeah, no doubt. I'm in no position to be picky. I'll head to the mass driver. I'd like to discuss other options. A, cre a key created by illicit means that allows access to the mass driver's facility in the third area. Okay. A disguise tag, huh? Got it. I'll keep an eye out. Right? The system Eve left for me. It activates when I lower my visor. Like all super anime cool and stuff. Aw, oh, man, I had all this backtracking planned. I was gonna... Okay, whatever. Oh, is it creating more rifts as I'm using it? Is it, like, that kind of a deal? D yeah, sure. I'll be careful. Oh, by the way, Kane, I have one more thing I need to ask you. Why are you such a dink? <laughs> Let's just say, hypothetically, if Eve really was responsible for reviving the mutants on Sophia... What would you do? N no. Yeah, I mean, that's kind of obvious. Yeah, he's gonna blow her out of the sky, dude. I also believe in me, because I'm Jason. Jason Fuddruckers. Understood, sir. Oh, we're doing sir now. We're doing sirs. Okay. <laughs> None of this sounds dodgy at all. Okay, so that warps me back to the beginning of the level. Awesome. Okay, where am I supposed to go now? Uh, what does this icon mean? SF Dungeon... Dungeon. Okay. So what is just a regular dungeon that I go into and do stuff? An SF Dungeon is where we go and we do the phasing and stuff, yeah? Something like that? I guess that makes sense? That was interesting. That was interesting again. This is the cutest thing ever. Go in peace, four-legged brothers. Nerds. I used to- I thought there was a way I could click a button and go inside the dungeon. Do I have all the stuff? I don't think I have all the stuff. So hold on. Oh, right, I could just warp. I forgot about that. Uh... 
I see some items over here. Let's warp. Nope, wrong button. There we go. Did that already get this item? Oh, I could just keep picking this crap up over and over and over again. Okay. Is there a, like, real item item? So greens and blue, or greens and uh, pinks are armor. A blue item, I'm hoping, is like a real honest-to-goodness item. Okay, let's get out of here. Like an, an actual thing I should care about. So in here should be that item. So I see nothing but greens and pinks all the way down. I'm gonna guess that's what it means. So where am I now? Hopefully an item is here? I've not the slightest. Gosh, spikes. I remember those being tons of fun. hell was the point of that? I'm very confused. Now where did this take me? To here, where there's also a rift. This is just an alternative way to get to... <laughs> so this is all superfluous. Right? All this is pretty much just for show. So all this must generate somewhat randomly? I guess? I'll take that. I'll take all that, thank you. That's not even the right way. Hold on. Yeah, this isn't even the right way. Okay, so let's go back. There's clearly a blue flashing, flashy, flashy here. But if I go in here... Nothing. Well, let's just go through the puzzle, I guess. Let's just go all the way to the end and see what we can find. That's a trap. That's a trap. So I guess all this is really doing is saving me from going through the guards. Right? I guess? So where would that one go? Yeah, literally just up and around, I guess. Yeah, I'm done with these stupid <laughs> floating platform things. I already unlocked all this, don't have to do it again.
Oh, is that the item? If I blow you up, do you have the item? Nope. Holy crap, you hard to kill. Wait a minute. Something's messed up here. Oh no, I'm out of bombs! Okay, well, we're doing this way. So the way this exit looks like, it looks like it'll actually come out in dead space, which is interesting. So see, the map only went up two squares. This one seems to go in a completely different angle, though. Yeah, because we're out of bounds now. Holy crap. Yeah, I'll just keep moving, thanks. Okay, so where does this lead, then? This must reveal the item. I guess? No, it just... Okay. I clearly went more squares to the left, but it just threw me here anyway. Interesting. Interesting. Okay, I've collected all the items. We're done here? Okay, now there's no item. So all that... <clears throat> excuse me. All that was was just armor. Is that correct? That whole effort was just armor? Yeah. Interesting. How did I get to the right before? Ah. Huh. That's one way to jumpstart your car. I don't get it. I think I'm missing some core concepts here. Let's go over here then. Pretty sure I just came from this way, but okay. Hello, friends. <laughs> yeah, it's just it's just as useless as the sewer key right now. I didn't know that's how I warped to a new area. Okay. Well, I just wasted a crap ton of time. Whatever, it's learning, right? So this is the mesh driver facility. If we launch G Sophia to Nora as is, SF Air Defense would shoot us down. We need the special tag that Kane mentioned to disguise it as freight. Gotta find that disguise tag somewhere. I will kick you in whatever your species regards as a reproductive organ, I swear. We have bigger problems. The mutants got here before us. There are even some blackouts, too. I bet all that polluted waters they're doing as well. Looks like it's it'll damage G. Sophia, too. Better stay out of that stuff. We barely have any supplies and gear as it is, so G. Sophia's giving out now would really put us in a rough spot. You know, maybe you'd think that since you're always flying around the Garuda, but vehicles usually have tires, you know. Wait a second. Is 
that much water, it's best if I don't use tires either. Oh, okay. Got it. Cool. Okay, so maybe it is a little more important. Camouflage? Yep, cool. These ladders always freak me out, because it's just more opportunities for me to accidentally kill myself. I saw a power-up, I'm going for the power-up. Nuts to everything else. Okay, so this is a permanent item. Life up. That's a permanent item, right? Dang it. Yep, I'm gonna call that... Permanent upgrade. So if it's a hexagon with no garbage in the middle, kind of feels like that's like a true, a tried and true power up. Oh, okay. Well, super glad I got that power up first. I don't think I would have been able to if that just cleared everything out. Yep, would not have been able to. I gotta go back and get it now. Man. Oh, I could have used, uh, Fred, actually. It wasn't that big of a distance, anyway. The camouflage is actually so good. Even if I'm actively attacking them, they don't do anything. Cool. Okay, so... Uh, this... This... Wait, what? I thought... okay. Whatever. Okay, now I can't make it through that, though, so I will need to do this. Uh... What the what? Okay, I can't use... Okay, let's just read the notes. Camouflage effect. If I could get Sophia over here, I could do something about this, but I can't. Okay, lasers don't help that situation. Just have to come back to that later. Ow, 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 ow. Uh... This is a little problematic. Oh, that's why. Because I came in here like the crab man. Okay, yep. I got it. Oh, you know what? Hey, hey, look at that. Can I... Wait, could I have done that under normal circumstances? Maybe? I guess too late to find out now. Figured that out a lot faster than I thought I would. Uh... 
Uh, I forgot what was over here. Nut bunnies. Okay, let's try it again. Oh, there's nothing over there. Okay, well, that was easy. Can't do squat over there. Oh, it's this time. Oh, okay. That wasn't disorienting or anything. Nothing? Okay, cool. Oh, is there waving to me? I can't shoot them. That's really cute. Now where the hell am I? I'm a little confused as to why any of that was necessary, but whatever. Oops. Ow, okay. I have to be a little more careful. So I could have just come through, or... Wait. There we go. So that got me into this area. Okay, it's impassable 100%. That makes sense. Okay. I was like, if I could have just walked down here, why in the heck was the... What was the point of all that? Okay. Stuff is starting to make a little sense. But not enough. That's still okay. Keep on pushing. Literally shoot them right in the head, and they don't react. I find that silly. Oh, you know what I might need? No, that doesn't do what I was hoping. Oh, I see what's going on. Yes, I do need that weapon. That's what keeps it triggered. Okay, cool. Good to know. Uh... Ah! I missed! No idea where I'm going. Uh, up, I guess?
As much fun as that wasn't. I don't even know what's happening anymore. Okay. Okay, health is looking better, gun is looking a little better. non-stop, isn't it? What in the hell is this? Spark Salamander GC. That was a rough one. <clears throat> Holy bananas. Ignition spark launches a, a plug into the ground or walls which sends electricity across surface while deploying a shield which blocks enemy shots. Power it up when activated simultaneously with the Gaia system. What? Oh, I can't check my menu or my map, so okay. How in the what? Later, nerds. Nope. Come on. There we go. Oh! Oh, okay. So what I want to do is I want to set it down and then slam on it, I think. Okay, maybe somewhere where there's not spikes. So now we just backtrack, I guess. Oh, you know what? I can just warp. I don't have to screw with any of that crap. Of 
cool. There's the map. Almost. Almost. Weird that there's no wall there and I can't pass it anyway. Alright, whatever. Okay, where to next? I guess backtrack? Uh, oh, left. There was some other crap in the way. Was not worth the purchase price, but that's okay. No idea if there's any items. Not sure where I'm trying to go with this, but let's just have fun, right? That helped out a ton. Uh, sure. Okay. Seems like a mini boss fight might be here. I'm down like a clown. Okay, you know what? Oh, so many baddies. Oh my gosh, what the heck? Okay, can't go that way anymore. be something else that powers that specifically. Yep, feels like this. I should have gotten on that. Why didn't I get on that? Well, the good news is it's actually impossible to get stuck. Maybe? Because the circuit is just long enough. Okay, this weapon sucks. There we go. I need it for the utility to get to where I want to go, and that's about it. Okay, got it. No, that's not what I want. I'm out of health. I'm gonna die. Yep. I saw that coming. There we go. Oh, I'm not on the right surface. I have to stop just tanking everything and actually think things through, I think. That's not really any fun, but I'd live a lot longer. So I'm kind of feeling about this game the same way I felt about Blaster Master Zero Two. An interesting continuation of the game. 
I honestly really liked Blaster Master Zero One a lot. It felt like a fresh rebuild of the classic. This has been, you know, same thing with any sequel, you've really got to keep upping the ante. More tools, more devices, more toys, more weapons. All that stuff to keep it fresh. No, I want to target that. Thank you. Not necessarily a bad thing, but it's certainly, you know, how do you keep upping the ante every time? Gotcha, jerk. This weapon is just adorable without any proper amount of gun. So what's my initial thoughts on this? I'm enjoying it. It's an interesting take on the premise. Uh, I joked before with episode one, like just starting up like, on the next episode of Dragon Ball Z, because it's like, how do you keep upping the ante over and over and over again and make the game worthwhile to play, you know? It's like, okay, we beat everyone on our planet. Awesome. What's next? Well, we beat everyone in the solar system. Okay, cool. What's next? Now we have to defend the galaxy or something. You know, it just keeps getting up and up and up and up. Which isn't a bad thing. It's just a lot. Like, what could possibly be next if this wasn't the last game, right? I don't even know. Uh, after we beat the mutants here, that's gotta be it, right? I know on the Steam page it does say this is the last of the series or whatever. Damn it! You know... Eh. There's two mechanics that drive me absolutely insane in video games. It's force damage when you enter a room. And the second one is... Oh, enemies just warped out of nowhere. Guess what? You're taking damage. Okay, my, I don't have enough gun for this. Let's try something else. That works. That sucks, but that works. Oh, it just dies. Okay. Sometimes Y works and sometimes it doesn't. I, ha I I'm having the same problem I had with uh, Blaster Master Zero Two. That this mechanic I should be really pretty intimately familiar with sometimes works or it sometimes doesn't. And unfortunately, I think I'm too stupid as to realize why it doesn't when it doesn't. Okay, I need this weapon again, I guess. Works for me. Did I actually kill it? Hold on. I want to know if I can actually kill those things. Wow, I can. Awesome. I had no idea. This next part's gonna be easier, now that I have proper grenades. Cool. Inefficient AF, but it'll do the job. Cool. And now you're going to get swamped. Okay, that's nuts. 
That's hella rude. Ow. You can just die. Oh, come on! <laughs> That's what produces those things. Okay. We're breaking into preposterous amounts of crap happening here. Oh, come on! Okay, if you're just gonna be spawning jerks, I'm just gonna run. How do I get past this part? Okay, I see it. Go, 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 go. No! Oh, it was right there, too. Ah, uh, okay. I need to take a break. This is getting frustrating. <laughs> okay. Whew, I need to get up. That's a little hectic. But thank you all for joining me. Name's John Megacycle. Another episode of Blaster Master Zero Three is in the books, and I hope to catch you next time. Hey there, guys, gals, fans, and pals. Thanks for checking out my video. I also want to take a moment to thank all my supporters and donators, and if you'd like to join up with me and Game With My Crew, all the information to get connected is in the description below. Thanks again, and I hope to catch you next time.